Hi everyone, this is Alex Vistana. I'm a 3D printing application engineer here with Trimec, and this is the uh, Know Your Materials. So in this series I plan to talk about a, a bunch of materials, uh, talking about you know characteristics of those materials, you know how, what they are, how they work, and what they're good at, to hopefully give you a better understanding of, of all the materials available on your machines. So to start this uh, series off, I plan on talking about PolyJet technology and their Vero resins. Uh, I'm going to talk about you know uh, how PolyJet systems work, uh, what the Vero materials are, and uh, you know some examples of parts that I have here, and, and talk about what they're good at. So let's just jump into it. So I want to start by talking about what PolyJet technology is. So PolyJet technology is a process in which uh, a resin uh, is dispensed, uh, whether it's one resin or multiple resins. So they're dispensed, then cured uh, with UV light, layer by layer. Uh, and this is at a layer of anywhere between uh, 14 to 30 microns. So uh, very, very fine resolution parts. So now that we've talked a little bit about what PolyJet technology is, uh, we can talk about you know one of the main materials that you'll be using with PolyJet technology, and that is Vero. Uh, so Vero can come in a wide variety of, of materials, all the way from clears to blacks to, to you know magenta cyan yellows um, so it comes in a wide variety of different colors and what you're able to do at that point is either print with that you know single color or depending on the machine blending all of those colors together to create uh, you know much more vibrant uh, models than you typically would have so an example of that would be you know something on a, a single material uh, realm would be something like this this gray part so this is a you know a single uh, you know, part good for uh, you know look, feel, uh, models, or even models that you know maybe color isn't that uh, that important for. If you just need that that high uh, accuracy, uh, versus something like this, which on its face, you know, looks very similar to to this part. Uh, you know, not much detail there. It, but uh, you know, once I flip this part over, uh, you know, versus this one, you get to see much more detail. So we've now you know embedded. Uh, you know, a circuit board in there. Some you can see the headphones clearly in there. So, um, for designers that are trying to you know communicate ideas, you know, sometimes something like this uh, speaks more volume than than just something like this. So, because these uh, you know Vera materials are acrylic based, you know, they can be post processed in a in a variety of ways. So they can you know be left in sort of a, a raw or as printed state, where it's something like this one. Um, all the way up to something like this, which is has been uh, you know bead blasted, uh, sanded, polished, and you know you get the full uh, you know movable parts on the inside and all of that. Uh, you can also photo bleach the the clears to allow for them to be uh, you know much more clear all the way throughout. So for example, this you know like a perfume bottle sample or something like that. Um, so you're not just limited to the as printed finish. You can you know take it uh, to whatever level of, of finish you desire. And that's the uh, quick overview on the Vero materials. It's a it's a you know a great rigid uh, material that comes in a wide variety of colors that allows um, for blending of all of those colors together to create um, truly. Uh, Beautiful models, um, everything from your you know early stage concepts all the way up to your uh, you know end stage color material finish part. Uh, if you'd like to see other materials, feel free to let us know and, and reach out to us at Trimac to see all of the other products and services we offer. Thanks.